वेलकम वेलकम्स टू यू इन माय ऑनलाइन क्लास आदित्य विक्रम राय यूट्यूब चैनल एंड टुडे आवर टॉपिक इज मेजरमेंट एक्सरसाइज टेन मेजरमेंट आई एम आदित्य विक्रम राय एंड टुडे आवर टॉपिक इज मेजरमेंट दैट इज योर एक्सरसाइज टेन एंड वी हैव टू स्टडी इज एंड इन दिस टॉपिक वी हैव लॉन डिफरेंट टॉपिक्स दैट वो in first measurement of measurement of length first topic was measurement of length in this topic we have learned about centimeter and a meter you know that centimeter is a unit of length we measure short length in centimeter and we can use a scale to measure short length is and now the next topic is meter meter is a bigger unit of length and we use meter to measure long length is such as the length of the blackboard a cupboard and a bed and the next topic was measure, measurement of weight and you know that the measurement of weight can, can be said in uh, there are two unit of measurement of weight that is gram gram is a unit of weight and we use gram to measure light things and now next is kilogram kilogram is a bigger unit of weight and we use kilogram to measure heavy things and now you have to come on exercise 10.2 let's solve it you have to which unit will you use to measure the weight of the following tick the correct box which unit will you use to measure the weight of the following tick the correct box you can see here that here given first is a cauliflower and you know that the cauliflower can be weighed in kg okay so you have to tick in kg and uh, the next is next one is a small girl the small girl weight is in will be in kg okay so we have to tick kg and the uh, next is there is a ring and you know that the weight of the ring is in gram okay so we have to tick gram and in next there is a flower and the weight of the flower is in gram so we have to tick gram <coughs> next is on fifth there is a wool and uh, the weight of wool is in gram okay the weight of the wool will be in gram so we have to take gram and the next is there is a beetle on sixth there is a beetle and the weight of beetle is in gram so we have to take gram once again the cauliflower in kg the gall in kg the ring on third the ring in gram on fourth there is flower that is gram on fifth wool there is also gram and on sixth beetle there is also gram and the next is next question is what is the weight of each of the following color the correct option what is the weight of each of the following color the correct option what you have to do listen carefully what is the weight of each of the following color the correct option in first there is a key the key's weight is about 20 gram so we have to color about 20 gram in second there is a book and a weight of book is about 100 gram so we have to color 100 gram okay and uh, the next one is on third there is a football and a football's weight is about 200 gram so we have to color about 200 gram on fourth there is a fruit of basket and uh, the weight is about 10 kg okay so we have to color 10 kg that means 10 kg on fifth there is a pineapple and the weight of the pineapple is near about 500 g so we have to color about 500 g and the next one is on apple and the weight of the apple is about near about 100 g so we have to color about 100 g once again the key's weight is about 20 g the book's weight is about 100 g the football's weight is about 200 g the fruit of basket is about 10 kg 10 kg on fifth the pineapple's weight is 500 g on sixth the apple's weight is about 100 g and now the next is match the object to the correct box you have to match the object to the correct box what you have to do match the object to the correct box okay so listen here and uh, the next question is match the object to the correct box 
and there is a hand fan and a crayon and cycle and papaya so the hand fan and a crayons are less than a kg the hand fan and a crayons are less than a kg and a cycle and papaya are more than a kg once again the hand fan and a crayons are less than a kg and cycles and cycle and papaya is more than a kg okay now come on next topic that is measurement of capacity the next topic is measurement of capacity i need more water to bath jumbo said i need more water to bath and uh, mumbo said i need less water to bath a uh, a bucket holds less quantity of water than a river a bucket hold less quantity of water than a river so a bucket has less capacity than a river the capacity of a container is the maximum quantity of liquid it can hold and we need different units to measure capacity jumbo said i need more water to bath and mumbo said i need less water to bath you can see here that a, a bucket holds less quantity of water than a river that means in bucket there is less water than a river so a bucket has less capacity than a river so bucket has less capacity than a river and a cap, the capacity of a container is the maximum quantity of liquid it can hold if any container is hold 1 liter water so then the capacity of this container is 1 liter the capacity of a container is the maximum quantity of liquid it can hold suppose that a container can hold 25 liter water so the capacity of the container is 25 liter okay and we need different units to measure capacity we need different unit to measure capacity what are these listen here on first there is a milliliter and a short form of the milliliter is ml m small and l capital the short form of milliliter is ml and the spelling of milliliter is m i l l i l e t r e milliliter milliliter is a unit of capacity we use milliliter to measure small quantities of liquid as like a cup of glass and any oil bottle and a mug can hold less water that is in milliliter we can measure the quantity this containers can hold in milliliter milliliter is a unit of capacity we use milliliter to measure small quantities of liquid as like any bottle of liquid any bottle of any oil and uh, a cup of tea a cup of coffee and uh, a mug and uh, glass it can hold less water is it can hold small quantities of liquid okay so we can measure the quantity this containers can hold in milliliters milliliter is a unit of capacity and we use milliliter to small measure a small quantities of liquid so we can measure the quantity this containers can hold in milliliters okay and the next one is liter liter is a bigger unit of capacity we use liter to measure large quantities of liquid that means any container any bucket any uh, a bottle that can hold 2 liter or more than 5 liter okay that can hold more than 1 liter is um, that can hold liquid in liter so that is liter is a bigger unit of capacity and we use liter to measure large quantity of liquid as like any bottle of oil that is hold that can hold 2 liter of oil and bucket that can hold 10 liter of water and big container that can hold 20 liter 50 liter 100 liter water okay and tank that can hold 100 liter 500 liter water are measure large quantities of liquid and we measure the quantity this containers can hold in liters liter is a big unit bigger unit of capacity and we use liter to measure large quantities of liquid as like any bottle of oil that can hold more than 2 liter and uh, bucket that can hold 8 to 10 liter water and any tanker any container that can hold 100 500 liter water okay and uh, we measure the quantity this containers can hold in liter and a short form of meter liter is l liter is a bigger unit of capacity and we use liter to measure large quantities of liquid as like any bottle that can hold 2 liter of water and any bucket that can hold 10 liter of water and any big container that can hold 20 liter of water 
and we measure the quantity this containers can hold in liters now come on exercise 10.3 the exercise 10.3 is which which unit will you use to measure the capacity of the following thing the correct option in glass that can hold water in ml okay milliliter so we have to take ml and the next is a swimming pool the swimming pools can hold water in a liter okay so we have to take liter on third there is a tank and the tank can hold water in a liter okay so we have to take liter and next one is a petrol pump and a, a vehicle can hold liquid whole petrol or diesel in liter okay so we have to take liter once again in first glass can hold water in milliliter so we have to take milliliter in second the swimming pool can hold water in liquid uh, liter so we have to take liter on third the tank can hold water in liter so we have to take liter and in fourth the vehicle can hold liquid in liter fuel in liter so we have to take liter next one is question number b how much liquid can each of the following hold right m for more than a liter and l for less than a liter so let's start in bowl less than a liter so we have to write l for bowl okay and the next one is in glass it can hold more than sorry it can hold less than water less than a liter so we have to write here l okay in bowl there will be l and in glass there will be l and in cup it can, it also can hold more, more than a liter it can also hold liquid in more than less than a liter so we have to write l for cup and uh, bucket bucket can hold more than a liter bucket can mo hold more than a liter water so we have to write here m and in mug it can also hold more than a liter so we have to write it write m okay and a uh, uh, pitcher that is gada so we have to write here m so in once again in bowl it can hold water in less than a liter so we have to write here l a uh, glass it can hold water less than a liter so we have to write here l in cup it can hold less than a liter so we have to write here l for bucket it can hold more than a liter so we have to write here m and in mug the it can hold also more than a liter so we have to write here m and in pitcher it can also hold more than a liter so we have to write here m come on next question that is question number c number the containers from the smallest capacity to the greatest capacity so the container with the smallest capacity so let's start in a spoon there is first and on second the bowl is on second okay so bowl is on second and uh, glass is on third and pitcher is on fourth and a bucket is on fifth and a tank is on sixth once again on first the spoon on second the bowl on third the glass on fourth pitcher on fifth bucket on sixth tank okay once again uh, the spoon the spoon hold smallest capacity so that is first after then the bowl can hold less ca smallest capacity so we have to write it two and uh, glass three and pitcher four and bucket fifth and tanker six thank you you have to do exercise 10.3 in your cw copy and fair copy